the beam of a ship is its width at the widest point as measured at the ship's nominal water line. The beam is defined as a bearing projected at right angles from the fore and aft line, outwards from the widest part of ship. Beam may also be used to define the maximum width of a ship's hull, or maximum width plus superstructure overhangs. Generally speaking, the wider the beam of a ship, the more initial stability it has, at expense of reserve stability in the event of a capsize, where more energy is required to right the vessel from its inverted position. Typical values, typical length to beam ratios for small sailboats are from 2 1 to 5 1. Large ships have widely varying beam ratios, some as large as 21. Rowing shells designed for flat water racing may have length to beam ratios as high as 31, while a coracle has a ratio of almost 1 1, it is nearly circular. Formula The beam of many monohull vessels can be calculated using the following formula. Where LOA is length overall and all units are in feet. Some examples for a standard 27 LFT yacht, the cube root of 27 is 3, 3 squared is 9 plus 1 equals 10. The beam of many 27 LFT monohulls is 10 LFT. For a Volvo Open 70 yacht, 70.5 to the power of 2 thirds equals 17 plus 1 equals 18. The beam is often around 18 LFT. For a 741 LFT longship, the cube root is 9 and 9 squared is 81. Plus 1. The beam will usually be around 82 LFT, for example, the Waymax. As catamarans have more than one hull, there is a different beam calculation for this kind of vessel. BOC. BOC stands for beam on center line. This term is typically used in conjunction with LOA. The ratio of LOA BOC is used to estimate the stability of mulchy hull vessels. The lower the ratio, the greater the boat's stability. The BOC for vessels is measured as follows, for a catamaran, the perpendicular distance from the center line of one hull to the center line of the other hull, measured at deck level. For a trimaran, the perpendicular distance between the center line of the main hull and the center line of either armor, measured at deck level. Other beams, other meanings of beam in the nautical context are, beam a euro a timber similar in use to a floor joist, which runs from one side of the hull to the other athwartships. Curl in a euro similar to a beam, except running in a fore and aft direction. Notes. References. Haler, William B. Kiva, John M. American Merchant Seaman's Manual. Cornell Maritime Prairie. ISBN A 0 87033 549 9 Terpin, Edward A. McEwen, William A. Merchant Marine Officer's Handbook. Centreville, Maryland. Cornell Maritime Press. ISBN A 0 87033 056 XA.